Sam's Cool Colors. Hi, and welcome to Sam's Cool Colors. Today, we are going to use this rainbow scratch paper to draw and color the Batman symbol. Wow. So to start, we'll take our pencil, wooden pencil, and draw the outline for the Batman symbol. So let's start here on the left side. Do is start out here and go with a curved line. Scratch it in to make it a little bit thicker as we go. Fantastic! And we can already see a lot of the wonderful colors that are coming out of the rainbow scratch paper. So let's go all the way around. Let's see how it comes out for us. We'll go up top. Make a straight line. Fill it in. Like so. Let's go back to the bottom. And keep that line going all the way around. So we can make that oval shape that's on the outside of that Batman logo. You see all of the colors are popping out. So many different colors. Yeah! I'm so eager to see how it looks at the end once we have all of the rest of our colors. In the inside. Fantastic! Let's keep going around just like this. And we're gonna have our oval finish out here on the right side. I like the rainbow scratch paper because it, because it's so much fun. You get so many wonderful colors and you get a nice different look for whatever you are drawing and coloring. Let's just fill in a few of these lines like that. Make them a little bit thicker on the outside. As thick as you want. You can keep going. I'll just fill mine in just a little bit more. And then we'll get to the inside. The nice part is you can scratch these in and just make them as wide as you'd like very easily. Okay, so now we have a nice thick border for the outside of our Batman logo. Now what we want to do is go on the inside. So let's start the shape of the left side of the Batman logo. So we'll start off on the bottom left here and just come to the point that's just inside of our oval circle. And let's go up, around, like so. Come up to get the top of the first side. Very nice. Fill it in wherever you think you might need it. And let's go back in. Let's start right from where we just ended up top. And we're going to come down and we're going to come around. Wow! First. side and come up to here fill this in don't worry it doesn't have to be perfect we're gonna color it in and 
interested to see how many colors come out at the very end. So let's see what we look like here. Let's go with a little line on the middle. And then what we'll do is, let's come back up, get the other side, and then we'll, we'll come back to it. We'll leave it there just for now. Let's, not, let's come to the middle of the bottom. So let's go back to the bottom line where we ended. And we're going to do two small loops. The first one is going to curve out and come out to about there. And then the second one will be here and come to about there, right in the middle. So you want that middle point to be right towards the center of where the Batman, top of the Batman symbol is on the inside. So now we can come back up to the top. Let's go grab the other piece of the Batman logo at the top, which is the other ear, the right side. Let's take this and let's loop this down, similar to the other side. Match it as closely as you can. And we're going to get a nice shape there. Excellent job. Great job. And so from here, same thing that we did on this side. Let's come around, follow the shape of the oval that you have on the outside and come down and around. So let's see what that looks like. Oh, very nice. Let's go back around if you want to finish that shape a little bit better and do that. Have fun with it. The rainbow scratch paper makes everything look nice. So let's go back around. Okay, we're gonna fill that in nicely in a little bit. So now we have a few more curves to do here at the bottom to finish out our Batman line. So let's take it right from that middle point on the bottom. We need two more curves to finish this out. So let's take curve and then one last curve to finish it out excellent so let's fill those in just a little bit to make sure we have the way we want wow looks very good yeah so nice work so far so we have some wonderful colors that are popping out just now but we can make this even more colorful. So let's go ahead and start to color in the rest of our Batman to see how colorful we can make it. Fantastic! So we are going to use the same uh, wooden pencil that we have to go ahead and color in the inside of the Batman logo. Oh. So let's do that now and see how it comes out. Wow, so far it's coming out so colorful. You see so many different color variations inside of the Batman. And what I like to do is sometimes I like to take a little napkin and just sort of clear it off. So that way you can see some of the wonderful colors even better. So just take a little napkin if you have one and just sort of clear it off just so you can take a look at it that much better and clearer. All right, so we're halfway done. Let's finish coloring in the rest of our Batman and see how it comes out.
Just one quick tip, if you are trying to color in with the rainbow scratch paper, a big space, you wanna try to get many different angles. So you can go up and down and also go side to side on an angle. So side to side, left to right, and it will help you fill in the space a lot faster. So try that if you uh, haven't already and try to get in all the little spaces that you can so you can get as many colors as possible. Okay, so we are done coloring in our Batman logo. Hooray! Let's take a closer look at it. Let's take our napkin again and let's dust off some of the extra extra leftovers that are behind from the scratching that we did. And now, wow, you can really see so many wonderful colors that have come out from our Batman logo that we drew together. You see some green, we see some yellow, we also see some beautiful pinks, uh, I see blue. So we have every color that you could want on a rainbow in our paper. And we did this using the rainbow scratch paper. So we made a really nice Batman logo together. We drew it and we colored it in using our wooden uh, wooden pencil. So great work today. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you had a fun time. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more Sam's Cool Color videos. Thanks for hanging out with me today and I'll see you next time.